If you've been to Sullivan's Island or Isle of Palms recently, it's likely you've noticed signs warning you of the presence of coyotes. Some argue the coyotes pose a threat to people and their pets. Others say it's part of low country living. But a bill introduced yesterday by a state senator is pushing for a coyote bounty program. It calls for raising certain fishing and hunting licenses to fund the program that would pay licensed hunters to lawfully remove adult coyotes. We spoke with one woman who says she's hopeful the state takes action against the invasive species. Really, you start to see a, a major decline in the other animals that are indigenous on the island. You know, whether it's rabbits, we haven't seen bunnies in, I don't know, three years now. Um, pet cats and feral cats have all but disappeared if they are allowed to stay outside. Um, even people with small dogs have to keep them on leash or watched um, in the yard. So they've become a major problem. The bill was recently deferred to the Fish, Game and Forestry Committee in the Senate.